Hi everybody, if you're new to my channel, I'm Lori and you're watching. 갑자기 내게 나타나주나. 난 아무 말도 할 수가 없었지. Hi everybody, welcome to day six of the Read and Rush. Can you believe it's almost over with? Tomorrow's the last day, and I only have one book to read. I changed it, but <laughs> you guys know me, I always change my mind. But actually, I changed my mind back to reading the first book. So, I decided instead of reading Ink Heart, I'm just not in the middle, in the mood right now for a middle grade book. Nothing's wrong with the book, don't get me wrong, but it's just I'm not really in the mood right now for it. I'm just, you know, I'm more in the mood for like middle, I mean, YA or adult books right now. It's just the mood. So, I decided to go back to what I, the, if I could talk, what I was originally going to read if I didn't get Ink Heart in time, and that is Ready Player One by Ernest Klein. I just started it, so literally I'm on page 26. Just finished page 26. So I got a long way to go, because it's like 372 pages. And if I finish this today, I'm still gonna participate tomorrow as well. I'll just read whatever I feel like reading, because I have a couple of books that are coming today. One of them I can't read because it's for next month, but the other two I could read if I want, so. I might, if I finish this one, I might read one, if not both of the other two. Or I might read Kevin, Irish reader. He loves this book, Simon versus the Homo, Homo Sapien, Sapiens Agenda, how do say it? He really loves this one. I really want to read it, so. Yeah. So this is another choice I can do if... If I'm done, if I get done with this today or early in the morning tomorrow. Because I don't know what's going on tomorrow anyways. Probably just grocery shopping. But hubby will probably come home and sleep for a while. Because if you're new to my channel, you didn't know he's a truck driver. So, yeah. So, he'll be home tomorrow and he'll be home for a few days. And then next Saturday, we go camping. So, uh, when he gets home on Friday... He stays home. You don't go back until the fall on Friday. So, yay. Which is nice. So, yeah. But, yeah, a week from today, we will be on the road to go camping. I'm so excited. I love to camp. And we didn't get to go last year because last year was family reunion. So, but this year, we get to go. Wow, I'm so excited. But I will be getting some books. And when they get here, I will show you. But I'm going to... Um, Go and see if the Fry Daddy's done because I'm making me something to eat. And I'm going to probably watch a couple of videos and play a little bit on Animal Crossing. And then later on, start reading. So, I will catch you guys all later. Bye for now. Hi, everybody. So, I haven't really read anymore. I've read a couple pages. Not enough to give you an idea. But as far as interesting, I tabbed a couple because they were talking about, like, things that I remember because I was born, as you guys know, right at 1970. So I was 10 years old when the 80s started. And I remember certain things. So like they were talking about, uh, what was it? They're talking about the, vi the, the very first video game system that, system that he ever owned, Holiday or Half, Halliday, or how do you say his name? Which was an Atari 2016. I grew up playing Atari. I loved Atari. And then it talked about uh, the sitcom, The Family Ties. Oh, I love Family Ties. Michael Keaton, oh, I love Michael Keaton. There are some good episodes on there, some sad episodes on there. And then they talked about a couple of gangs, games, like, I never played Burger Burger Time, but I did play Donkey Kong. I loved Gon Donkey Kong. And they were talking about some other books, I mean, other games, I mean, that I didn't, um, I didn't uh, tab, though. But, yeah. My thing, since we're talking about 80s, because of the book, my favorite game was Pac-Man... Mrs. Patman, but Patman was my first favorite. We, um, story time, um, me, my sister, 
her boyfriend at the time, who she wound up marrying and divorcing, of course, and my boyfriend at the time. We would play Atari all the time. We would play Pac-Man and we would play and we would play and play until we turned it and had to start all over again. <laughs> yeah. And we used to play that all night. Sometimes we'd stay up all night playing that game. Me, my sister, her boyfriend, and my ex-boyfriend. <laughs> okay, into story time. I got a book. I got my book for uh, a beautiful bookish Bethany. As you guys know, I'm a Patreon of hers. And this is our pick. So sneak peek for my part of my TBR video. But um, this is our book for... Um, I got so much garbage. I need to clean up my book room later. But we are going to be... even. I've read this already, but it's a long time ago. So I'm glad I have it because I don't remember what happened. But we're going to be reading Kim Harris, um, Dead, Wit Dead Witch Walking. I love the cover of that. It is neat. Oh, look at this. I don't even remember. I just know it's about vampires. Vampires. I can't get away from vampires, can I? I just read vampire books. But it says, um, all creatures of the night gather in the howls. Of Cincinnati to hide, to prowl, to party, and to feed. Vampires rule the darkness in in a predator eat predator predator world, rife with dangers beyond imagination. And it's Rachel Morgan's job to keep the world civilized. A bounty hunter and a witch with serious sex appeal and an attitude, she'll bring them back alive, dead or undead. And I remember some of this, but I don't remember enough. I know, I think there's Jinx, I think, is one of the characters. I can't even remember anymore. Like I said, it's, yeah, Jinx. And I forget what her friend's name is. Um, I don't know. Can't find her friend. <laughs> but I do remember it. I know that there's that one guy that she doesn't like at first. Is it Trent? something I can't remember oh Ivy is the is her friend's name and yeah Trent is the other one I believe I thought I saw his name just a second ago but I lost it but I'm pretty sure it's Trent I'm just not seeing it now but anyways I do I have read it but I never finished the series I mean, I got pretty far into it, don't get me wrong, but I didn't read. I think I got to like six or seven, maybe eight. I don't know. But I did have it before, so. But now, if I, li if I, if I like this as much as I remember liking it, I will probably go ahead and continue on in the series and annotate it and actually try to, like, read it. <laughs> you know, the whole series. So, yeah. So, um, that's a book that I got today, and I'm still expecting two more books. One says it's out for delivery, the other one doesn't say it's out for delivery yet, so we'll see. But I'm going to let you guys go. I'm going to read some more in Ready Player One, and I will update you either when I get to page 100 in Ready Player One, or when my next book gets here. Alright, bye. Hi, everybody. I'm still not very far in the book. I'm only on page like 49 or something like that. 47, I don't know, something like that. Some of these ones are hard to tell. 47, I'm on page 47. He hasn't started like really looking for anything yet, so nothing's really going on. I don't know, I'm trying to like take my time. I was gonna try to like finish it today and then tomorrow just read whatever but I think I'm just gonna take my time today I mean if I do finish it today yeah that'll be good but if I don't then as long as I get to like page 100 between 150 and 200 I should be good but I got another one of my packages and then I'm just waiting for one more let me see if I can get these open because these I don't like these ones they're so hard for me to open like my fingers do not want to work 
See them dropping it because I'm a klutz. Fingers don't want to work. I filmed a video that you guys will see on Monday. Uh, I'm trying to get my my cut thingy. <laughs> don't let my cut thingy. Because I suck at this stuff. So, by now, the book I got, I got to clean up my mess over here. I throw all my stuff over here and then clean it like once a week. <laughs> but I got uh, a Werewolf in Riverdale by Kelb Roherg or something like that. He's the one that wrote the, um, <laughs> what did I forget? The Fell of Dark. So, yeah not very long it's like 200 in and make sure it's lighter it's just it's like another one yeah that's it's like a this prologue or something like that yeah so there's 296 pages so it shouldn't take me that long to read this when I do read it. This is, spoiler alert, one of the books that I'm going to be reading in August. And you'll see what it's about in my video. Spoiler alert, that's going to go up on Monday. So yeah. But I'm excited, you guys. Excited, excited. Now I'm just waiting on one more. And then I don't think I have any books coming for a little bit. But yeah, I will jibber jab with you guys all later. Hi everybody, my last book came. So I just was going to hop on here. I haven't read anything because I've been watching videos. And I'm trying to take today easy. So if I finish the last book, I do. If I don't, then I don't. That's the way I'm going with this last book. <laughs> This is what I'm really excited about because so many people talked about this book. And I have never read it. And that is Da 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 Heartstoppers, Volume 1. I've been wanting to read this. And it was, like I said before, on my, if you saw my, it, um, if, you, if anybody like looked at the links that I laid down below for my, um, my uh, wish list, birthday wish list for so my birthday is next month so yeah and this was on there but i took it off because i bought it myself because i couldn't wait to see if anybody was gonna buy it for me so i was like i'm gonna buy the first one and then maybe if i like it someone will put the other one will buy me the other ones that are out we'll see usually no one buys me anything off my wish list so <laughs> but that's okay we're not here to talk about that. We're here to talk about books that I got. But yeah, they look so cute. I just know that they fall in love. That's all I know about the book. And I don't really want to know anything because I want to go in blindly. And this don't look like it's going to take any time at all to read. So a lot of these I'm probably going to be taking camping with me. A lot of these little books. I think I'm going to probably take this with me camping um uh, the one I got the werewolf one that I got which was this one of course probably take these two camping with me and I got a couple of other books that I really want to take camping with me I'm gonna take a lot of like littler books so I'm really excited. <laughs> and look at it. It says, boy, boys fall in love. Look at them. They're so cute. <laughs> I'm so ex uh, I'm excited. Well, first it says, boy meets boy. Boy becomes friends. Boys fall in love. <laughs> and I've never read a book by um, Alice Oldman before. I don't think I did. What was her books? I don't even know what she wrote. Have I read any of her books? 
I know I've heard of them, but I don't think I've ever read any of them. And it doesn't tell you on here, I don't think. I noticed you did radio silence? Yeah, radio silence and solitaire. I'm not sure what else she wrote. But I don't think I've read, ever read a book by her, so this will be the first book I've ever read, read by her. I'm really excited. But yeah. So those are the three books that I got in the mail today. Woohoo! But hopefully I'll get some actual reading done. I'm just, like, in the mood today just to relax and just do whatever I want. So if I decide to read, I'll pick it up and read. If I don't, oh well, you know? That's how I feel. You get, like, those on days, right, where you just, like, okay, I'll pick up a book. And if I read it, I mean, if, I'll pick up a book if I feel like it. Like it. If not, then I won't. <laughs> And that's one of those days today that I'm having where, yeah, I just want to take it easy and just do whatever pops into my brain. But yeah, I'm going to let you guys go. And if I get any more reading done, I'll update you guys. Bye for now. Hi, everybody. So I got over 100 pages in because <laughs> I told you I was going to update you. When I at least got into the hunt, and we got over, uh, got into a hundred or over, um, on page one twenty eight, and I'm just to the part where, spoiler alert, where, um, uh, God, what's his name? Um, Wade is his name. Wade. I always forget what his name is. I think it's Wade. Well, anyways, his friend um, just um, finally um, scored in the get in the thing but yeah it's good I mean, they're talking about so many things that i remember from the 80s like um risky business with tom cruise um do they say something about patrick swayze i think i think they talked about um no no i don't think they did never mind i don't know what i'm thinking <laughs> Probably because I was li I'm listening to some music as I'm reading, and I was listening to um, to um, oh my gosh I can't think of the name of the song can't remember oh I know I was listening to um, no they did mention whiskey business in here and I was thinking about the scene. In risky business with Tom Cruise, where he, where he's just in his underwear and he's sliding across <laughs> while he's dancing. I can't remember the name of the song because my brain right now is not working. They mentioned Footloose in here. Footloose, Footloose. I love Kevin Bacon. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Um, what else did they talk about? They talked about the um, the Rubik's Cube, which I sucked at. What else? I talked about so much stuff. Uh, oh, War Games? With Matthew Brodick? Brodick? I know I've watched that before, but it's been a long time. I need to watch some of these um, old movies again. They uh, talked about... Um, my mind went blank. It's one of my favorite movies. Oh, um... There it went again. I had it in my brain and then it just flew away again. Like a little bird. <laughs> but anyways, um Oh, I know. <laughs> I forgot again. It keeps like right there, you guys, and it goes. I swear I know the name of it. Oh my gosh. The Breakfast Club. That's it. The Breakfast Club. They mentioned the Breakfast Club. One of my favorite movies ever. Um, they talk about, like, uh, oh gosh. It's another, um, it's another John Hughes book, a movie. So they were talking about a lot of them. Pretty in Pink. They were talking about, oh my God, what's the other ones? You know, the one weird science, science, that one. I talk about different things like that. Like, I just like love reading books where they talk about stuff like it that I that I know. 
but right now the book's okay. I would say it's like a three star. Like the, it was boring until page like 70 or 80 and then it started getting better. So yeah, but I'm gonna try to get to where my pink is, which I'm almost there. I'm like right here and I wanna get to where my pink is. So it ain't much more. I'm at least gonna try to get to that, but I will probably keep reading on. But once I get to that part, actually, I'll probably finish that. No, I think that was the end of it. That's the beginning of the next chapter. That part, yeah. So I'm on chapter 13, and I need to get to chapter 19. And then once I get to chapter 19, I will update you for the last time tonight. But I might continue on reading. But yeah, at first it felt like it was going to be a two and a half, three. So we'll see, maybe um, since I'm starting to like it now and it's starting to, you know, to get the clues and everything like that, it'll probably wind up being between a three and a half and a four. But I definitely am liking it enough that I think I will continue on because I know the next one comes out this year, Ready Player Two, One. Is it Ready Player One Part Two? Or is it Ready Player Two? I don't know, I think it's Ready Player One. I don't know, Part Two, I don't know. <laughs> But anyways, I'm just really excited. I wonder if they're gonna make a movie since they're gonna have the book. That'd be neat. But here I am rambling on. I'm gonna let you guys go because I'm gonna go to the bathroom, throw my garbage away, and then I'm probably gonna read until like a quarter to eight, between quarter to eight, eight o'clock, and then we're gonna clean the house. I'm cleaning out here in the book room and like the hall area. I always do that. I, I sweep up all the hair and vents, uh, the girls pick up, and then vents vacuum is like the, the, um, the, the carpet and the couch because <laughs> Rowan gets hair everywhere, you guys. Rowan gets, I mean, there's so much hair in my book room from that dog. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to let you guys go and I will update you one more time before I end the vlog. So I'll talk to you guys then. Hi everybody. So I read a little bit more. I wanted to up to end the vlog here. You know I'm gonna keep reading after I'm done talking to you. <laughs> after I'm done with the vlog, I'm gonna keep reading. So I might finish it tonight, but otherwise, I'll definitely be finishing it tomorrow because I'm on page one sixty nine pretty good I think it's basically staying with the um the movie it's been a while since I watched the movie so I can't remember everything that happened in the movie but some of the, what I remember from the movie has happened but some feels like it's missing a little bit but I don't remember what it's missing it just seems like it is <gasps> but I'm enjoying it it's not gonna be a favorite book it feels like probably maybe a four star. Right now it feels like a three and a half, but it feels like it could te te could technically or tentatively be a 3.75 or maybe 4.25. I don't know. We'll see at the end of it all. But yeah, I'm almost to where I wanted to be for tonight, even though I'm going to keep reading, like I said. Um, I wanted to get to 180 and... 180 at least. And like I said, I'm at 169. So. But I just wanted to update you guys. So this will be the end of today's vlog. Day 6. Tomorrow's the last day, you guys. And I only have to read a hundred and something more pages. And I have completed every single book. Every single challenge. Which would be the like I said, the first time I've ever managed to do it. So, yay! I can't believe it. But, yeah, I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye. Good night. And happy day six. And welcome. Or tomorrow will be day seven. And get ready for it. Night.